Great works of art, whether displayed in museums or private collections, can potentially be affected by many issues. Surface dirt, discoloured yellow varnish, smoke, even small tears and holes. Painting conservators care for works typically painted in oil, acrylic or tempera paint. And today I'm meeting one based near Norwich with over 10 years experience. Well I've always had a passion for art and one summer when I was doing my History of Art degree at UEA I did a work experience placement at Norwich Castle Museum and I worked in the conservation department and I just really fell in love with the profession from there. It was just a great experience. Well, restoration kind of was a term used from the mid-19th century when a handful of artists across Europe started working and treating paintings. Um, in the UK it wasn't until after the Second World War that the big galleries like the National Gallery and the Tate Collection had their own restoration studios and employed restorers to treat works of art. So that's really when the profession has really taken off and been defined as a conservator restorers. Ah, so Alice, tell us a little bit about this painting and what you're doing. Well, at the moment I'm just retouching some damages in this face. Um, there was quite a few bits of flaking paint and also these cracks that are quite disfiguring to the viewing of the image. So I'm just minutely putting in some retouching just so that damage doesn't look so apparent. But this painting has been quite badly damaged in the past by a previous restoration and someone's cleaned through some of the delicate glazes, which I now have to kind of um, soften and put back. But um, that tends to happen when amateur restorers try and clean something when they're not trained and they don't know what they're doing. So I'm putting that back. Well, I recently worked on a painting called Expectation and it came into the studio. It was very, very yellow, very, very thick dirt on it so many cracks and flaking paints and it just went through a total transformation whilst it was here in the studio. It belonged to a private client of mine and they were just thrilled when they got it back and it was just transformed beyond belief. So the varnish is removed first and then I'll put on another new fresh coat of varnish and then I'll retouch on top of that. So my work is always differentiated from the original, it's not sitting on top of the original. So at a later date, if someone needed to take it off for some reason, they'd be able to see what I'd done and, and take it off. So Alice, we can see here in the face of the lady, just in the short period of time we've been with you, there's been a real difference. So thank you very much for inviting us in today to have a look at your work. So if any of you who are at home with your great works of art, or even your small works of art, and you want them repaired, there is somebody in Norwich who may be able to help.